name is Barbara Rianji Mutavazi, founder of Women in Technology Uganda. When I graduated from university in 2009, I spent a number of months looking for an employment opportunity and I couldn't find one. But I remembered I had digital skills. I was a good web designer. So I started looking for work opportunity from smaller businesses that were looking maybe to build a website or to design something for their businesses. And I realized I was earning almost the same as what I would be earning if I had gotten a job. So I became comfortable in that domain of running my own small business. And before long, I remembered the young women that were in my community that also were out of a job or they did not have a job. And I decided to teach them the skills that I knew. And what impressed me and what inspired me was that when I taught them these skills, they were also able to either start their own business or be able to work for other small businesses as either web designers or even just IT administrators in those companies. And that inspired me to start with Which is playing a role in closing the technological gender gap, contributing to women in science and technology by making sure that we have a safe space working with working with women, inviting them to take on tech as a neighbor and embrace tech as part of our mind thing. We are doing a number of programs on how to improve um, skills uh, for women and also girls in Uganda, called Girls Program, where we do train uh, girls in uh, best computing skills and also programming skills. Uh, we introduce them to Scratch programming and also Python to make these girls ready for this uh, for the outside world. We have uh, the Elevate program which targets the girls out of school, those who have dropped out at different levels because of the different issues. So uh, basically this one we train them in best computing skills and uh, they go out there to become secretaries, uh, to become maybe tellers and so, my name is Akit Gloria. I came to V2 as a trainee in 2018 under the Elevate program where we did a number of modules. At the end of all these trainings, I was able to attain a certificate. And the beauty about it was that we 2 retained me and I am now a full time employee in Women in Technology Uganda. I started off as the front desk person. But as of now, I am the Administrator and Procurement Officer at Women in Technology Uganda. So I'll be able to transfer the skills and knowledge to other ladies out there and be able to shape their future, just like we to shape mine. Thank you.